What up, sports fans? My name is Hip Hopper. You're watching Hopper's Hip Tips. And uh, today, it's time for a little Coliseum action. You know what I'm saying? So, yesterday, Sunday, they post, there was this, like, there was this random post on, on the forums. It wasn't, like, it wasn't an announcement or anything. It was just this random post. That, and they were like, oh, hey, there's a Coliseum tomorrow, and it has consequences for the future, blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, what the crap? So, uh, so then today, they, this afternoon, they finally announced it for reals, I guess. And uh, so we're going to check that out really quickly here. So basically, uh, basically, it's like Pussycats versus Comboka, right? Basically. And um, uh, this doesn't... This doesn't actually give a whole lot of info. Hold on, hold, hold on a second. So here's the actual like mis mystery post that they posted yesterday. Uh, Indemnity posted this. You know, new Coliseum beginning 722 consequences. Uh, so depending on the clans played, the winner of the Coliseum. Uh, Pussycats or Kamboka or both. The lore will change considerably. Um, and so basically they're saying, oh, you know, if Pussycats win, then maybe... <laughs> there are a bunch of maybes here that I'm like, yeah, okay, maybe some of this stuff will happen, maybe not. I don't know. But they're saying, like, if Pussycats win, then maybe, like, you know... Uh, Maybe a Kamboka card leaves in disgrace, becomes collector. Perhaps the leader, Kuwaka, becomes a collector. Or perhaps a Pussycats card, uh, like Florida Jane CR, becomes MT. Um, if both win, no clue. Maybe another clan becomes involved, blah, 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 whatever. If Kamboka win, uh, maybe, you know, the staff uh, makes Kaiseering go CR, despite only being in the game for a few days. Either that or Charlie becomes a collector or blah, 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 right? I mean, this, you know, so there's just like a bunch of maybe what ifs here. And I'm like, okay, whatever. But assuming that, that, any, that some of these are possibly correct, um, I am throwing in with Kamboka. And this is probably where I, first of all, I don't want Kaiserin to go CR because I don't have her yet, so that would that would not be cool for me. It wouldn't be cool for most players, I think. Uh, but the other thing is, you know, if if Kamboka win, um, then uh, I stand to gain the most, I think, by Kamboka winning. Uh, for example. Um, well, I don't know. I think I stand to win the most uh, by Kamboka winning because um, well, I don't know. Actually, reading this now, I'm like, maybe it would be better for Pussycats to win. That's what's dumb. Is like, we just don't know what's going to happen, right? So, hmm. I was gonna go. I was gonna go Kamboka, but now I'm like now I'm rethinking my decision here. Do I want to go? Do I want to go Pussycats instead? I don't know. I don't have Kaiserin as the thing. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with Kamboka. Okay, I'm sticking with Kamboka. And I guess we'll just see what happens. I don't know. But basically, um, the rules are. I mean, here here are all the prizes and things. So you can get some of the big um, Pussycat and, uh, and well, some of the big Pussycat cards, and, as well as Vulcan CR. Those are the prizes. And then, uh, basically, you, just, you need to play 40 matches, okay? And um, so that's not too, that's, that's doable. I think this goes, how long does this go? doesn't really say, does it? Um, starts yesterday, ends yesterday. No, that's, that doesn't work. Um, deck format. So you have to have at least eight characters. 
Um, they have to be at least 26 stars, and they can either they have to have um, at least one of the following clans: Pussycats or Kamboka. So you can do a split deck, but it has to have Pussycats or Kamboka in it. And um, I guess if you really wanted to, you could do like a Pussycats and Kamboka deck. But uh, you know, whatevs. Um, you start with 14 life and 12 pills, and you can't use characters that are ELO banned. So it's basically EFC mode, but with um, 26 stars. Okay? So yeah, I'm going with Kamboka, sticking with Kamboka, and uh, there's the Colosseum there. So it's, it's ready to go, and we're going to play um, several matches here. Probably 10, I guess. Our first 10 matches, and we'll see how we go. And uh, this will kind of allow us to see uh, kind of what, how things are going, what people are what people are playing with, and stuff like that. So this is uh, Gikal, a Colossus level 151, and he's got um, he's got Raptors. He's got Raptors and Nabrissa here, and that's probably that's that's a good uh, that's a safe bet against Kamboka because Kamboka have a lot of life, um, or sorry, a lot of uh, what was I going to say? A lot of attack manipulators, right? So um, so Raptors would be a good one to face Kamboka with. That makes sense. So here comes Star of Legend, and we're just going to take it with Kubra here and gain a pill and a life. And he didn't attack. That's okay. All right. So next up, uh, we're going to toss Jaegen here, and we're going to go uh, 24 attack because that can win a draw with Clarice or Quinzel. That's kind of my thinking there. And let's uh, let's make our cards bigger here. So we're down two life and down two pills, which is not a nice place to be, but whatevs. So he goes a full-on full 40 attack with Quinzel here, and that's going to be ugly. Um, so let's see, Clarice has... Well, he's not using Clarice with, um, with her ability, so that's all right. So she's an 8 times 9. So let's go eight times nine, shall we? See if we can win a draw here. He's probably gonna sucker punch me here. Let's see. Is he just? Did he just fake with her? Yeah, he faked with her. What ups? So we drain a little bit of life there, get a pill back, um, and now Pavum loses to Nabrissa. All right. That's cool. We're getting our feet under us here. Not a big deal. But um, that would have been a nice one to win, unfortunately. After he won those first two rounds, it was kind of kind of put us in a bad spot. So Nabrissa hits us for two. That's game. And we gain a point. Yay us. So game two of ten here. And here is Fowler CG, a Colossus level 150. And it looks like he's got Pussycats as well. Pussycats and Sentinel here. So three Sentinels and a Shotzi. And of course Shotzi's going to be at full power. Unless I uh, use Pavum on him. Of course St Statum's at full power too. So, Ugh. Uh, Brawl's, Brawl's killing me so far here. So we're going to toss Jaegen here with, um, we're going to go no pills actually on Jaegen. And he's, he's bringing Statum, so he's probably going to hit me for a dick ton here. For seven damage. Alright, but he paid for it, so that's cool. 
So he throws Lara Hate here, and we're going to throw Rizom with his Cancel Power and Damage mod. So, uh, Lara Hate is what? She's a 7 times... Um, Seven times four is twenty-eight. Thirty-six, pa thirty-six attack. So we got to go forty-two attack. We're gonna cover her fury here, but she did not fury. Oh, she fake. Look at that. She went all in. All right. Well, I thought he might do that, and that's okay. Um, can we beat him now? That's the question. With furies, can we beat him with furies here? Um. Let's see, let's go like this and Fury with Pavum. That'll get us over Z Robbie here. He's gonna throw Shotzi instead. So we hit for six, we gain a life and a pill. And now what? Even if I hit for four here, that's not going to be enough, is it? It'll, it'll be a draw. Let's see, z Robbie is a 15 attack. Yeah, I can't do it. I can't Fury, unfortunately. So, dang. So two losses straight out the gate here. Not encouraging. Um, yeah, so so far Mono Kamboka is kind of hurting me a little bit. We gain another point there. Good game, Fowler CG. This is game three of ten. We got, oh, it's Fowler CG again. Look at that. All right. So uh, my turn first, and I'm going to toss Jaegen here with, um, we're going to go two pills actually. Just to just to switch things up a little bit, you know what I mean? So he's gonna try to copy no, he's gonna is he gonna throw Lara Hate or is he gonna throw Z Robbie? It's Z Robbie, so he's gonna copy my my pills bonus here. And he attacks for a ton. So he hits me for two and gains a pill on a life. Interesting. So now it's now he's coming at me with Harvey, and um, against Harvey, I think we're gonna go with Kuwaka. Uh, let's see, Harvey, what does he hit for? Um, it can be a fifty-six. Let's be a 63, shall we? Now, you know what? Let's go all in here. Um, seven times eight is 56. Sixty-four. Okay, we're going to go three pills here. Call me crazy, but we're gonna go three pills here. Perfect. <laughs> there we go. That's what I'm talking about. So, we are up three life and up five pills now, and that's Egg Solande. So, all we have to do now is hit with Pavum. And uh, Lara Hate is what? A seven times eight, which is 56, 64. She's a 64 attack. That's why I saved back some pill, some pillage here. So uh, we'll go 64 attack. And that should win us the game, actually.
Oh, maybe not. Let's see. Lara hate Lara hate can hit us for eight. Is that right? Which will uh, no, she can't. She can't. There's no way she can fury, right? So she's only gonna hit us for six. I don't know. She might be able to fury. I don't think so though. So here comes Lara hate. We'll throw all our pills on Hillal here. Yeah, she didn't fury. So we got some nice revenge there on Fowler CG. How you like me now, Fowler CG, huh? Egg Solande. So there's our first win. Pick up four points there. And uh, we're on to game four of ten. A couple losses and a win so far. So uh, this is King Top, 3806. And he's rocking... Uh, He's a master level 44. He's rocking Mono Kamboka as well. But let's see here. I get to go first, so um, obviously it's going to be Jaegen. I'm just going to one pillar just in case. Just in case he gets any ideas, right? So he's going to throw his own Jaegen at me. And let's see who d who did better. Oh, he did. <laughs> okay. But um, he is down one pill. Uh, but he has a nice five life gap for that one pill. So he definitely came out on top there. So here comes Utom. And against Utom, I'm just going to throw Pavum here with... Um, I don't know. I guess we'll two pill. Nice. So we hit for four. We gain a pill and a life. And um, we canceled his cancel. <laughs> so that's nice. So let's see. So, so, that, so that evens everything up, basically. And um, so now I think I'm just going to toss Hillal here. Um, with Fury. Because Doigu can win standing still, you know what I mean? So he throws Seta here. Is he just going to take it? Oh, sweet. That's perfect. So we blast him for, I don't know what. Um, what's the gap now? The gap's at four. And actually, Kubra can beat us. What the F? Dang it. Why do we keep sucking? All right. So Kubra gets to Fury here for the win. Dang it. Thought I had that one, but uh, no such luck. So uh, we gain another point, and uh, we are going into game five now with three losses and a single win, which is not, not how you want to be playing in a Coliseum, you know what I mean? Now, my philosophy on Coliseums is, you know, play them. Play, play the Coliseum. It's free stuff, right? Um, you know, even if you don't do really hot, you still get some free stuff. Uh, so you may as well do it. So, uh, my turn first here. So this guy has a full hand of Dominion. I assume he has either Pussycats or Kamboka in there somewhere. But he drew all of his... Dominion cards. So, um, let's throw Pavum here. That kind of cancels out Nidori. Um, it also cancels out Frago. Frago's defeat. So, um, let's go 40 attack. And we'll get hopefully get through and get a pill and a life back. I have a nice 5 life gap to show for our troubles here. So he tosses Frago. Is he going to attack? That's the question. 
He does not attack. Well, he used a, a couple pills, actually. That's even better. So, um, basically, we get a five life gap for two pills there. Not bad. And now he's going to toss uh, Nidori, and I don't even care about that. We're just going to take it with Kubra here. So, um, he blasts us for four, closes the gap by four, but we're still up two life and, um, and three pills, so that's nice too. So now, now what? Um, Bakum is an eight minus three, which is five. So I guess here, let's just one pill, let's just use Bakum's free pill here. And I went and bought Bakum specifically for this Coliseum today. I was gonna, I should have bought her Friday, but you know, I would have saved myself a couple thousand clans, but no biggie. She, her price hasn't gone up too far today. So, not a big deal. So here comes Gulyug, and he just takes it like a man. Boom. And that's great. I think we're, I think we're okay against Kaboom here. Now he can hit us for four, which would take us down to, um, to nine. So he could get a draw, but um, I think with our minus 20 attack going on here, I think we're good. So let's just let's just win the round, baby. Exolande. All right. So uh, that's that's game. There's another win for us. So we got three wins and two, uh, three wins and sorry, two wins and three losses so far. Heading into game six here. So not amazing, but uh, not horrible either. Could be worse, right? We could have five straight losses here. Anyway, uh, this is Black Rabbit, a Titan level 88. He has. Um, Three ghost towns and a Rizom. And of course, Kuwaka's equalizer isn't going to be all that amazing here against, you know, a bunch of threes and twos. So, I guess we start out with Hillal, maybe? Um... Yeah, let's throw Hillal, and let's go... We'll use half our pills here on Hillal. How about that? So his Rizom's ability is going to be pretty much useless this game. because I don't have any power and damage mods, but he's going to toss Bambino here so he can avoid my Rizom. He's a 9 power, I'm a 7 power. And he got me, dang it. Alright. So that, I think that's pretty much game here. Uh, I don't think I'm going to be able to recover from that. So he's going to toss Dizzy Vulture, and uh, let's see. Oh, one pill Kuwaka here. See if we can get a couple pills back. Oh crap, okay. And I just handed him a crap ton of life there. So, um, yeah, that's game, baby. That's friggin' game. So we'll just toss uh, Kubra here. He's going to toss, is he going to toss Dakota? That's interesting. I guess he doesn't need his revenge 
ability with Dakota, does he? He just needs to win the game here. So he does that. Ugh, that was miserable. So taking it down to 13, go up to eight, or go up to nine, I guess. Uh, not a good win, not a good uh, loss there at all. So good game, Black Rabbit. We are on to game seven of 10, with only two wins and what, five losses, is that right? No, two wins and four losses, I guess. And this is Atler, a Titan level 91. He's got, uh, Three Junks and a Kubra here, and I get to go first. So, I guess we'll toss Kubra here um, with no pills. And I'm hoping he'll just take it with his Kubra. But who knows, maybe I'll get Kubrick out of the way. Nope, he's going to toss Travis Legend instead. So he's going to get five damage in here. Yeah, ouch. But we gain a pill on a life. So um, that's a four. We're down four life and up one pill. Could be worse, I guess. So now he throws Cubic. And against Cubic, I'm going to go with. Um, Kuwaka gets completely gutted by Cubic, so I don't want to throw her. Um, Hillal still is um, fairly decent against Cubic. So let's see if we can go... Um, see if we can go 48 attack here against Cubic. Nice. Okay. So we get through there. Um... That evens the life gap, but we're but we're down two pills now, so that's not so good. Um, I'm gonna throw all my pills on Kuwaka here. So let's see, um, he's thinking, I guess. We got Blink, we got Kubra. He can pretty much beat me with, with Blink if he wants to, and that's game, right? But, I mean, he does have to be careful of Doigu. Okay, so here comes Blink. He's, he's going all in. He furied. That's interesting. Oh, perfect. Perfect. I didn't even think about him furying. That's, that's awesome. So, Kuwaka versus a four-star. That gives us a nice lead there. Uh, 16 life and five pills. And we just have to basically beat Kubra here. We don't need to do anything fancy. Boom. Egg Solande. So that was, that was a nice win there. So we're heading into game eight here with, um, what, three wins and four losses, I guess. Let's see if we can even it up here. So it's Atler again. He's going to want some revenge, I'm thinking. Uh, he has three um, three junks and a hillal here. And I have uh, my girls going on. So, um, oh, let's see. He's got Cubic sitting there trying to, beat, trying to beat me up. We'll go 48 attack again. And... Uh, on hill all. See what that gets us. 
I was going to throw Blink. Interesting. Blink without her growth. Oh, but he got us. Look at that. All right. So he hits us for six, but he's down one pill. But uh, I'd, I'd, call that a, I'd call that a win for him. So here comes Romana, I guess. Yeah, here comes Romana. We got to throw Kuwaka here, and uh, I'm gonna go 45 attack with Kuwaka, which is actually 40 attack when we factor in Romana's ability. So uh, that puts me down one life, up one pill. So that's not too bad. Um, And I guess here, uh, what do we want to do? Doigu gets beat by Cubic, no matter which way you slice it here. Um, so we're going to have to win with Kubra, basically. And um, I think what I'm going to do here is cover... Let's cover Cubic's Fury here. Yeah. So he's a seven times, what, four, 28, 36 attack. So we need to be a 42 attack with Doigu. So I think he's gonna get a little revenge on me. Good job, Atler. So what have we seen today? We've seen Junks, we've seen Raptors, we've seen um, Pussy Gets and Kamboka, obviously. Yeah, he didn't Fury, he just attacked. So here comes Hillal, and we can't Fury now. Um, of course, it wouldn't have mattered, would it? All right, so there's another loss. So the only way we can even things up now is by winning these last two games. We gotta win both of them. Um, and that's just to, that's just to be, be at 50-50, you know what I mean? So it's Atler again, what the crap? Why do I keep getting the same guy? Um, this time he has a couple of Kambokas and a couple of Junks, so See how that works out for him. So he, th he tosses Romana to start with. We'll throw Hillal with 40 attack. Nice. So we hit for two, drain a life, gain a life. Drain a pill, gain a pill, and that puts us up four life and down two pills. So now what? Now, um, now I guess we just throw Kubra here. Yeah, we'll throw Kubra with no pills. He'll probably just throw Travis Legend, right? Oh, he throws Pavum. Interesting. Did he attack? Okay, he used one pill anyway. So, um, that puts him up one life and up two pills. So that's not so good. And here comes Rizom.
Oh, he's going to throw Travis Legend. That's interesting. So Travis is, um, what is he? He's a 12, he's a 20 attack. And I'm a 2 times, I'm a 20 attack too with Kuwaka. So that's not going to work so well, is it? But if I let him through, then what? Rizom is a, is what, seven times? He's an 84 attack, is that right? And I can be a 90, I can be a 90 attack with Kuwaka. So let's just let him through here. With Bakum. Oh, but he furied. Interesting. All right. Well, that's fine. I can fury too. So. What's that going to get me? It's going to get me um, three, six, seven, right? Dang, he got me. He friggin' got me twice. Damn it. Got the KO. Ugh. Damn it, Atler. Ugh, I hate that. Okay, that pisses me off. Oh, okay, calm. Calm blue ocean. Game 10. So we did not end at point five today, unfortunately. Here is Cersei, a Colossus level 121. He's got Kaiserin at uh, semi-evoed at three stars. And uh, he has Lois Legend and a couple of um, couple of Ulus here. So we'll use Yegan's free pill here. Because if he hits us with Ice Gym, we're going to need that extra, um, that extra attack. But it looks like he's going to toss Liliana, uh, Liana Legend instead. Get his heal going here. All right. So he hits us for three and uh, starts his heal going. And now what? Now is he going to toss Ice Gym? No, he's going to toss Kazirin. And against Kazirin, I think we want to throw Bakum here because she's not going to be affected by Kazirin's silliness. So we're going to attack. Perfect. So we blast him for one, drain him for a bunch, gain a pill and a life, and uh, that puts us up three pills and up one life. I like it. So now let's see here. All we really need to do is use Pavum's free pill, right? So that's what we're going to do. We don't really need to win this round. Uh, we just need to win with Doigu next round, basically. So he tosses Ice Gym. Perfect. That's why we won pilled. That's why we won pilled, because Ice Jim would have won the won the draw with us there. So now, here comes Lois Legend. Um, I am a three power. She's a seven times six, which is 42, minus 20, which is 22. And I am a nine times three, which is more than that. So suck it, Lois Legend. Booyah! Egg Solande. 
So there's a nice win. It's nice to end the day with a win. I like that. So you can gain a couple of heal life points, and I don't care. So we picked up four points there. Uh, that leaves us at 22 overall for the day. And um, I think I have a vanilla daily box I can open here. So let's do it. Yeah, here's our vanilla daily box. What do we got here? Anything good? We got Lurg, Battle Points, and Clints. All right. Well, there you go, guys. There's your first taste of Coliseum. Um, hopefully that was helpful for you. And um, my name's Hip Hop, of course, and this has been Hoppus Hip Tips Special Edition, Special Coliseum Edition. Please like, subscribe, tell all your friends, and bring you back here tomorrow for some more hot Coliseum action, baby. And uh, we'll see you then. Thanks, guys.